Where are we? Tell In me. The studio. Day one. That was two. Day one. <laughs> Hi, I'm Edith, and I sing and meet me at the altar. We got here yesterday, you know, we're setting up drums. <laughs> wait, wait. So after being signed to Feel by Ramen, writing music was kind of a little different because we have an audience that is waiting for us to release stuff and they're eager to hear. So throughout writing this EP, it was really, really fun, and we were so excited to get to Chicago to record with Roy again because we love him so much, and it just made perfect sense to keep going with him. I am really stoked to be working on this project. It's going to be good. <laughs> it, wasn't that like a lot of character? Yeah, yeah. That was a lot of character. Like, so I'm trying to make Edith. You know, I think that it's excellent. Wait, let me give you a neck. Yeah, I don't got a neck right now. My name is Taya, and I play guitar for Meet Me at the Altar. So collectively, we felt so much anxiety, good and like a little bit bad, but not bad. Just like we're nervous um, because this is our first like major record release but we're super excited about it and we put our heart into this music um, it just feels like us and that's what we're really excited to show the world my name's Ada and I play drums for Meet Me at the Altar before coming to record drums honestly I get so excited because I just love being in a studio and I love being with the girls with Roy as well and just I don't know, I was just really excited being at home and like practicing all the time. My name is Roy Robley. I am a musician. First and foremost, a musician, uh, later producer. I think I still have the email. I think it was like 2017, 2018. So they, they emailed me and they're like, hey, we, we'd love to work with you. I think they told me like a little bit about themselves. So it was like this like YouTube band and it's like three girls from like three different states, and I'm like, they were like, okay, cool, yeah, we're gonna we're gonna fly out and we're gonna record with you. They they flew out here. We recorded four songs, but I knew like when when we were done with that record, that EP, that first EP I did for them, I knew that there was something really special that we had just done. Well, the biggest thing that was different when writing after signing is we moved in together after we signed, so there's more of an option to work together in a room when it comes to writing. But the only thing that really changed with our writing process is <laughs> Tan and I write lyrics together in the same room. Other than that, it's the same exact way we used to be doing it with like texting and kind of going into our own corners and writing our part and then coming together with it. At first it was an adjustment moving in together, but we kind of got used to it really quick. Um, and our songwriting process didn't actually change that much. We kept writing our own parts separately, but instead of being states apart, we were just rooms apart. So I would literally hear Edith as she was writing her melodies and be like, yeah, girl, like this is so good. Or she'll hear me like coming up with guitar parts. Um, but it's been, it's been nice being able to be together because we don't have to go months without seeing each other because we're friends. Like it's, it's fun being able to, you know, hang out with your friend all the time. <laughs>